And when I woke up after they took my hands, they took all the stitches and staples out. And then I went to rehab after that. But in between when I had the accident and I woke up after they took my hands, I have very little memory. August 19th, 1985, I was working on a crane and the operator either got too close to Highline Wire or hit one. The electricity was turned on while he was up there and uh, he suffered pretty severe burns and they ultimately decided that they had to remove his hands. Uh, according to experts, it was 24,000 volts and the circuit breaker kicked in a 30th of a second. He started coming to us uh, in the late 80s. We started making him uh, body powered hooks. After 30 years of the body powered, my shoulders are just shot. He was developing osteoarthritis in both shoulders. So the wear and tear of utilizing those hooks um, started to just degrade his shoulders. Logan showed me these prosthetics. We, I see them in a book and then he showed me a little video of them. So Mark is the first bilateral amputee in Kern County to receive Michelangelo hands. And once I got them, the biggest challenge now is learning how to use them. Build us right over there. Can you straighten your arm? And you can you have speed control with rotation too, so you can go wicked fast or you can go you can it go really slow. There's myoelectric sensors in the forearm of the prosthetics that we've designed for Mark. When he fires the flexors and extensors in his forearms, it, it operates the hands. Let's see. Yeah, that's big hand. That's little hand. They have more official words for it. I call it big hand, little hand. This is better for like a, a styrofoam cup or something bigger. This is like. If I'm right-handed, but this is real good for a fork or a pen if you're going to write. The future of myoelectrics is going to be with mind control prosthetics. The patient will be able to actually think and the hand will operate as opposed to um, utilizing muscle signals to, to operate the hand. Now that I have the hands, I'm excited because I can do more things. I can do them better and faster. I'll be out of the shoulder pain I'm in now. And between these and them together, I think I think it'd be a, a better life. I am getting a little older, so I better take care of a little better myself.